There we go, we're in. Welcome back to the River Foss Fishing YouTube channel. Today we're back for our first river session. It's June the 16th and we've gotten up bright and early. It's now about half four in the morning and we're already on the river fishing. Hopefully we will get a fish and be rewarded for getting up very, very early. I'm the first person on this stretch of river. There's no more cars in the car park. So I picked a swim that has done really, really well for me in the past. And today we're just going straight for gold. We're going for barbel, aren't we? So we will see what the morning brings. If it passes without too much um, indication of any fish, I might move up and see if I can find some deeper water. With the lack of rain we've had over the past few weeks and the really hot temperatures, the water is very low, the lowest I've ever seen it. So we might have to do a little bit of swim hopping and see if we can find some fish. Good fish, a good fish. Ooh. I mean, this can only be a barbel. to move downstream it's a little disconcerting <laughs> let's uh, move up just in case Ooh, phone that was close it's like digging under the rod tip there just slacken this drag off a little bit and Oh yeah, I just had a quick glimpse, not enormous, but a very good fish. There it is. Yeah, a little, it's a little one. Oh, he just wrapped himself around the line. That's not good. Ah, there he goes, freed himself, excellent. Trick him in, bring him upstream, and then no, no not quite. He's getting there, he's getting there. In he goes, absolutely brilliant. First barbel, and that bite came so quickly. Oh. Well, after only about 43 minutes, we had our first bite, which was an absolute ripping take. I forgot I left it on the bait runner. So he was taking line and halfway down the river, it seemed. And um, let's just get him out for a quick look. There it is, an absolutely amazing barbel there. And the first one of my river season. Let's hope there's many more to come. Well, 
Well, I'm really made up to catch that first fish and it's just reminded me what river angling is all about, just the absolute excitement of catching something from the relatively unknown. When I got down this morning, you know, I said the water level is low, I don't know if it's going to happen, and then a barbel after only 45 minutes is absolutely brilliant. I've rebaited the spot and um, I'm going to have a celebratory coffee. <laughs> to see if I can uh, get rid of some of this tiredness for getting up so early, but totally worth it to catch a fish like that. I'm around to half six now, which means I've been fishing about two and a half hours. I've still only had that one fish, which is fine. It's still very early then, There's still time. There are quite a lot of bubbles coming up on the opposite bank, so I might just put a straight lead on, a fresh pellet, and flick it over there and just see if I can uh, hook into a fish, see if they are fish. I'm going to keep the bait going into my spot, however, to try and draw any fish in the area up and towards me. All right, fresh bait and a little bit of a different tactic. I'm going to have to overarm cast this unfortunately, but... Well, nothing much was happening in that spot anymore, so I've decided to move. I've packed up my kit and we're gonna go upstream and see if we can find another good looking swim. Well, I got myself packed down and back to the car. In the end, I only had that one fish really early on. I had absolutely nothing the rest of the day. And I think just the sun is so bright at the minute, uh, the, the fish are just not feeding confidently when it's bright. Um, if I was less tired, I'd probably stay right through and fish the evening into dark. Um, but I got up at three, so I'm pretty knackered. I'm gonna get myself home and get some food.